Hey everyone, have I here? We have another video on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. In this video, I'm going to show you actually how to use Raditz correctly. So with that, if you're new to my channel, like, subscribe, comment below, do all that good stuff. Let's go ahead and dive right in. What I mean by that is, all you can really use Raditz for is a 170% Pure Saiyan's leader. Because besides that, not all that useful. So what I'm going to show you here is a extreme Super Battle Road run with the Pure Saiyans category and Raditz as your leader. And of course, we got to bring someone else as a leader because if you had Raditz as another rotation, like two of these on the same team, you're dead, right? You're dead. So this is what we're going to run here. This, this is how we're going to do it. Extreme Super Battle Road, Pure Saiyans. And again, the nice thing about this, you can run all the seven year anniversary units. Um, they are all good here. <laughs> I can't even hide them. I'm dead. I'm dead here. Yeah, I was going to show you how to use this, but uh, I'm already dead without using an item. So let's run and see if that works out here. Um, look at this bad key management as well. I can't even get a super off. Pretty much he's dead. Here's, here's what I'll do. I'll just use an item right now because... I want to continue this run here and show you just how bad there's bad key management because he doesn't link with anybody. His links, Raditz's links, by the way, his best linking partners are um, Heroes Super Saiyan 4 Broly. He got the support Broly, which is fine. If he ever gets his easy A, it's going to be really good. You have easy A Mass Saiyan and then an SSR version of the... Raditz. I don't know why even that's on there. So that's the five linking one. And uh, should be fine here. Um, yeah, should be fine. Here. And the nice thing also about the this Vegeta here is he's I'm getting one link. Um, is that he is getting a 200% buff. Really the only unit here that's getting a 200% buff. Wow, Vegeta's getting actually rocked here. 35,000. That's a lot for Vegeta. <laughs> he is, uh, the Raditz can link up with other units as well, but just overly not. Like, great, we all know this, right? And as I'm building up my best teams, I know you guys have been waiting for best teams. That is going to come out pretty soon here. Technically, he is a 200% leader, and it's, again, not very good at all. The, um, you know, his game mode effect of this is one of the worst. Like I've ever seen, like a new unit come out. It's uh, it's very bad. Am I gonna survive this? Yeah, sure. 194. Wow, this run is not going well, by the way. I'm already needing to use, um, you know, items and such. I'm gonna actually do this. Uh, it's a shame that I have to do it this way. I should survive. Right, without using an item here. 39,000. If you super me, I'd be in trouble. I'm gonna have to heal already. <laughs> I'm used to doing no item runs, man. I have to use items on this, uh, on this Raditz run. And I know a lot of people are making jokes and, uh, you know, memes and things of that nature for this unit. And it's deserving, though. That's the thing. It's deserving, but, you know, I think hopefully in the future they add a lot more units to support this because, um, I actually don't even know how to make this, this unit better. They should have buffed them a little bit. That's what they should have done. So I got to heal up here. This next stage is actually pretty rough here. Go on, hits really hard. Um, and then yes, he is in the way. Um, yeah, it doesn't matter there. I'm going to... It'd be nice if I can get off a stun, right? But I don't have the key, I don't have the key management for that. Uh, I got a heal, so I'll just do this. I 
can AoE it up. Again, really, I, that's the only saving grace for <laughs> for Raditz. He does do a AoE, so he is World Tournament approved. Um, but who really cares about World Tournament these days, right? I'm showing you this, right? Being that if you don't have a pure Saiyans leader, and you all of a sudden were able to single or discounted Raditz, you can run the stage this way and be a okay, right? Uh, this is gonna, he's gonna have 30% damage reduction. Let's see how his defense is here. Hey, that's not bad. He's doing ditch, single ditch. I, you know, I'm glad. I'm glad for that. All right, uh, we're gonna get type advantage here. So let's do. Yeah, this is gonna be rough as well. Um, yeah, let's just do. I'm just gonna use a bunch of items. Let's already used one. You, you tend to either use no items or period, or you're gonna use, you know, uh, all the items, right? I'm gonna try to knock out Go Gohan here first. But well, hopefully you guys have enjoyed the seven year anniversary. It is technically going to be over in a couple days from this video being recorded. You know, Raditz is the placeholder. We are gonna get some heroes stuff, superhero stuff. Uh, hopefully a awakened SSR Gohan. Uh, since JP, I think, would get the same celebration, I would assume, um, you know, getting as, as a global release, and yes, JP version already had the SSR version come out, um, you know, I think it's beneficial for, you know, the awakening for that SSR superhero Gohan. Oh, I didn't kill him? All right, this is a kind of a surprise. I didn't expect. Um, you know what? I can actually. Aha, I can do this. Maybe get lucky and stun him. Uh, we're gonna knock you out. And then I'm gonna be type disadvantage, so hopefully I can. I don't get supered at the tail end there. I'm taking a little risk, especially if I don't if I don't stun. Hey, Extreme Super Battle Road's still tough, right? If you are bringing kind of a weirdo team like I'm doing right now, I'm bringing the 70th anniversary units, which, you know, in longer events, they're a lot better, right? Because when they transform uh, and they're able to do those uh, crazy active skill attacks, um, that's that beneficial. Plus, they stack, right? So longer form, it does work out. Well, what is going on? Uh, at least he supered me, 100,000, instead of uh, Vegeta there. Dude, Gohan won't die. <laughs> there he is. All right, I mean, you're probably gonna get hit pretty hard here on the on the on the regular attack. Oh, I always dude, I always forget how good the EZA of of him is. Uh, you know what? I don't actually have the active skills on, so I'm actually gonna turn that on here. Options, active skills. Uh, off. I'm not doing the interest animations, so so let's do that. Let's let's do this. Let's fuse, Kakarot. You're the last person I expected to suggest. Just for funsies, right? Just for funsies, entertainment purposes. This is going to be special. I can feel it. I know you guys haven't got enough of this. Already. There's Gogeta, and I should be able to do the after skill attack right here, right? No, not yet. Thought I could. Is it next turn? Or am I not under enough HP? No. Well, that's a shame. I'm just gonna do this then. Guess there's no need to play games. I'm pretty strong this time around. Yeah, it didn't time stun him, so I'll, you know, Goku's at a little bit of risk. And of course, Raditz at all risk there. So. That all, huh? 
Huh? Is it my turn now? Time to show you what real power looks like. You're dead! Oh, I got the stun off. There it is. Is it a guaranteed stun? I do forget about that. Oh, there you go. That's, again, this is how you use Raditz. <laughs> He's an item when you can use his active skill. Took a while, though, right, to kill Gohan. So reason why we can use his active skills right here. Alright, well this run is taking a lot longer than I expected, but uh, at least you guys get the picture, right? Raditz has some level of redeeming value if you don't have a Pure Saiyans leader for some odd reason. And Pure Saiyans is the largest category in the game, so highly, highly recommend you definitely use that here. Uh, I'm not liking that last part there, but I can't stun. Um, so I'm gonna go this guy here first, right? I'm gonna have type advantage initially. Can't get the... Uh, oh man, this is bad key management. Alright, bad key management equals you're not attacking me. Yeah, this is awful key back there. Ooh, there's a stun opportunity here. And for those who don't have Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, he is, anytime you can use him on Super Battle Realm, he is king. Right, he can, has the ability to stun. Generally, he's not going to link up very well unless you bring someone he can link up with. And uh, he does take zero damage, right? So. Now I gotta think about this a little bit more. Yeah, just again, awful, awful key placement. Um, I'm gonna go down here. I'm just gonna spread the love. And this should be okay. Even though if I get supered, I have a shot. I just don't want to die, but like, so you guys get the picture. If I die here, I don't care. <laughs> uh, you guys got the picture on what? Damn, this awful key management. Brought the wrong units to link up with. Oh no, this was the uh, leader. Time to get serious. All right, Dokkan mode here. I still might die though, because if I don't really KO anybody, if he super attacks Goku and I don't dodge, uh, I might be in big trouble. So. Wow. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Alright, I always forget, 7 year anniversary is reign supreme, so 7 year anniversary for the for the dub. Gotta live that Dokkan mode at the end. Use a couple items. But that, my friends, is how to use Raditz. You put him as a floater, you just keep him as a um as a uh, uh an individual just laying on the side there. Complete your super battle road run. It actually has the how slow was it the last time? Um, anyway, yeah. That um, was 15 minutes last time. I played really slow and I st still can't play it. So there you go. Uh, I think that was a no item run though. The 15 minutes was a no item run one. So this right here is uh, not a no item run. So, and uh, there, you, there you have it, boys and girls. That's how you run Raditz. And uh, um, there, again. So with that, if you're new to my channel, like, subscribe, comment below, do all that good stuff. Thank you all for watching. Keep on Dokani. We'll catch you next time. Later.